Good morning from Malta. Cannot wait to get off, can we? We're so excited. So excited. It was gorgeous uh, pulling in this morning into Malta. Um, and I'm so excited. Malta, home of Maltese dogs. Eurovision Song Contest Eurovision Maltese entries. Maltese entries, and of course, Maltesers. Yes. <laughs> Do Maltesers actually come from no. Malta? No. Or oh, it's just the fact that the malt. They've got, got malt in there. Yeah. <laughs> I was going to say. But yeah, plan is we're going to go down for our breakfast now. We're all showered and ready. Yeah, it's the first time we're experiencing breakfast on board. So, yeah, so we'll see what it's like. Have you got your, have you got your armor on, your elbows out, yes. ready to go? I am ready to go and fight for, that sausage. Fight for the sausages of the world. <laughs> So guys, we're just getting an Americano from the bar. We got told off for not standing in line, even though it's not very clear. But the bar staff are having a right fight with each other. It's literally hilarious. They're literally arguing with each other because I don't know if they know what they're doing, but it's really, really funny. So I've had to come away because I couldn't help but giggle because they're literally having a full on fight. It's actually not too busy in here this morning and the food from what I've saw on people's plates looks really nice. So uh, we shall see. Wow, guys. There are delicious coffees. Are you ready? Should we go get a seat? That is a good coffee. It's a good coffee. So we're in the Marketplace bar. Okay guys, so I've been and got my breakfast. It's actually pretty good. There's a really good selection of hot breakfast, American style, loads of pastries and desserts and fresh omelettes cooked for you. Yeah, it's really good. So this is what I've got so far. Hash browns, some scrambled eggs, bacon and sausages and some nice bread. Plus I've got my coffee and my orange juice. Lovely. Are you going to go get some David Joe board tag team? Uh, this is mine. I'm just, I'm having a light breakfast this morning. Having just, a light just having breakfast. a coffee. I don't believe you for one second. Is the camera off because I'm going to get loads of food. <laughs> Bye. What you get David? So I got um, a vegetarian omelette, some salad -y bits with some selection of what looks like really nice breads. It's really nice bread. Yeah, and it's actually not too busy up there. And they had a really big selection. I am actually, I'm quite surprised. I haven't eaten it yet, but let's see. I have finished mine and it was absolutely delicious, really good. I really enjoyed that. The selection is huge. I've got loads of desserts, which I'm gonna go for now. But yeah, the food looks really good. Looks really fresh, really hot, really tasty. I'm really surprised because we saw so many negative reviews about the food, but to be honest, all the food we've had so far has been pretty good. We haven't really had a bad meal yet, have we really? Our specialty dining last night was a bit average for specialty dining. Like we said, it was it was nice, but it was sort of main dining room standard on yeah. other cruise lines. But the buffet's been, it's been nice. Yeah, not bad at all. Right, I'm gonna go get my, my second course. How is it, David? Really, really nice. Good. I'm really surprised. It is actually delicious. I've got my um, second portions. We've got the really, really like their sweets, the Italians. So I've got some gosh, cake with some yeah. jam on it. And I've got waffles with banana foster. So bananas with like a toffee sauce. Yeah. And just to say the omelette was um, <coughs> was made to order and you can just go up and ask for any sort of eggs as well. So you don't have to just get the eggs that are sort of out there. You can just go up and say, can I have this type of egg and they will do it for you. Yeah. Lovely. Okay. We're going to get some sweets after this though. Should we make a move? Yes. Yeah. Cool. So we're going to go get some bottles of water because they're free on our dining package, on our dining package, on our, on our drinks package. So we get a big bottle of water each to take off. So we've got plenty to drink in um, Malta. I'm going to grab a cup of tea for the room as well. Wow, there's like so much choice for tea. Wow. Actually, how much oh. choice? David. Oh, you pull it out. <laughs> what I you was like, oh, it's empty. I was like, oh no, wait a minute, you put it out. Oh, <laughs> yeah. So you've got a selection of juices as well. So pineapple juice, orange juice, water, and fresh That's what fruit. You had this I had that, it was good. So that was a successful first try of the um, the buffet, wasn't it? For breakfast. That wasn't bad. Yeah, it was actually pleasantly surprised. Pretty good. Yeah. It was busy, but it Ooh. wasn't. 
any busier than normal on any of the cruise line. I know, right? Oh, it's really sunny. Look how sunny it is. It's pretty nice. It's still a little bit chilly. Yeah, it's still chilly, but sunny. The solarium's really nice, isn't it? Yeah, it's really nice. It's Real good for sunshine. when it's cold outside. That pool looks look much more full than it did yesterday. It does, yeah. It looks really nice. So just here, we're just going to get our bottles of water for the letter. Then we're definitely going to come back, aren't we, and do some, um, some swimming. Nice and warm. Oh, We've got a really big pool there as well, which is cool. Nice big jacuzzi. And a nice roof for when it's um, cooled outside. It's great. Is this roof open? Yeah, yeah. yeah, the roof opens up. So it will sort of all open. I really like it here. Yeah, me too. I like the water. There's some really nice seating areas down the sides as well. And there's some hot tubs upstairs, isn't there? Yes, there's two hot tubs upstairs that like overhang. Yeah. And you get like a great sort of 180 view from it. Uh huh. Yeah, it's really, really pretty. I really like the solarium. Love it. Yeah, you've got these um, screens all over the ship as well, which are really handy. Tells you the weather, so it's going to be 15 degrees. Oh. Yeah, 16 degrees and clear. I feel like um, I'm on the morning weather. Program. Good so morning, today. cruisers. So today in Valletta, it's going to be 16 degrees, wind clear, with temperatures of high of 18 and a low of 13. So it tells you some of the things you can do in um, Valletta as well, which is cool. So the it's an UNESCO World Heritage Protected Tarn site. Soak your feet in the beach. Oh, so you can look at the top things to top see. Top things to see. Komono, Komino Island. Oh, that looks nice. Located between Motlan and Gorza. Oh, that looks pretty. It's a cathedral. Yeah, that looks really pretty. Wow. So down a few decks. Hola. Bargiano. I don't know if that was the right language or not. Guys, we're ready to get off the ship and go to Malta. Malta. And we're off. But it's nice and warm today. Make sure I'm not getting run over. Gosh, isn't she beautiful? There's our room like just up there. Well, it's a gorgeous day. It's really warm, isn't it? Really warm. It's hot, hot, hot. There's the um, MSC Musica, our sister ship in the Meraviglia just behind us. Of yeah, course, really. Really, Queens. Oh my god, it's literally roasting. Oh my god, it's like really hot. It's like really odd because it's quite chilly in the shed and then the sun's burning. So guys, you can get a horse and carriage as well, just outside of the, the ships. Yeah. Yeah, like Sydney Yeah. Quite cool. But yeah, the MSC music is huge. So guys, on the notes of movies, we've actually found a movie trail. So you can go and see some of the sites that where these, these were filmed. So you've got Gladiator there, Clash of the Titans. Eunuch, Assassin's Creed, Game of Thrones, yeah! Oh, yeah, there Game of Thrones, 38. 38, where's, where's, that? where's that on the map? So, oh, there we go. Oh, yeah, cool. We'll have to go find that. David's just taking a couple of photos of the ship. She looks beautiful, doesn't she? What a beautiful yeah, ship. She looks really pretty. Stunning. Absolutely gorgeous inside out. Inside and out, yeah. Not inside out, because we don't. Inside out. Okay. We don't want our. We don't particularly want our ship to be inside out, do we, Dave? More stairs. <laughs> Yay! We love our stairs. In fact, I actually, really do not mind the stairs because they do provide us with some actual exercise because we're eating so much crap. Wow, this is really, really pretty. So glad the sun came out. It's nice to see it after a few days of rain. Yay, no 
made it to the top. That view is gorgeous. So pretty. Whew. Is that Good upstairs of the deer? This. Oh, it's really weird because look, they've got like um, zebra crossings that we have in the UK. Oh yeah, proper zebra crossings. That's funny. Love it. This view is spectacular. I'm loving like the new ships in the front, in the foreground with the old buildings in the back. It looks so pretty. It doesn't look big enough to host three cruise ships, ships, does it? Yeah, so in the picture we've got the Musica, Favel Socia or something in the Maravilia. Favosia or something? It's not the Favelosa, is it? It's no. a Fava, Fava, Fava Socia? Fava Socio Path? Socio Path? No. It's a good cruise lane. <laughs> lame. <laughs> Okay guys, so we're here in Valletta, in the centre of Valletta, which is just a short walk from the cruise ships and we have one of the main streets. You can't get lost. There's the main square there and pretty much all the buildings that are of interest are all around this area. So come on, let's go and have a look around. It's so pretty. It's, it's really, really weird. It's really pretty. I can't put my finger on like if it's, it's like Mediterranean or. It's kind of a mishmash of a few things. It's a bit like feels a bit like um, Spanish. Yeah. English. But it looks really unique at the same time as yeah. well, doesn't it? You can. It doesn't look like anywhere else. Like the buildings look almost maybe French. It, but it's really nice. And then, but then the shops look really British. So it's yeah, really, it's a real strange. Um, it's a mix. Oh, we've got McDonald's coming up on the right hand side. <laughs> For all those people who are not adventurous on holiday. Or if you need a wee. <laughs> if you need a wee, trust you know, in McDonald's. <laughs> exactly. Wow, it's really reminding us of the UK. You can get all of the British newspapers. And then we've got New Look and BHS. Then you've got Peacocks of London. I love it how they've made it look posh. It's like the least okay. posh shop ever. We have a Peacocks in our town. <laughs> Literally, guys, this could almost be a UK high street. <laughs> so pretty, isn't it? The buildings are gorgeous. Sorry guys, we're just perving over the guys. Sorry, we're just... <laughs> There's a lot of hot men around. There really is. Come come to the med. Come to the med for the men. That's our top travel tip there with honest cruising. You caught us having a bit <laughs> of a perv. Okay, but yeah. These buildings are beautiful. Just still having a wander, aren't we, Davey? Having a gander. Having a gander around. Got a bit lost. Valletta. It's actually really beautiful. It's really unusual. I can't believe how unusual. It's really unusual. Yeah. It's really pretty. Like it's really unique. It's really unique. Thing. Wow! Look at this. It's gorgeous. Well, Let's like cross the road. Oh my gosh! Look at this. How steep this is down here. It's really pretty. Wow. Really, really unusual. It's really unique. Look at all of the different colours on the buildings. They're really strange. It seriously feels like I'm on the set of Game of Thrones, though. Like you can see a scene being shot down here, can't you? While well, we've just came down there. It's quite high up. But yeah, on every corner you have some lovely statues and gorgeous buildings. But yeah, it's so pretty. Shame. 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 My gosh, David, it's like being back in Blighty. So I ring mother. She ring mother, darling. It's got a British telephone box here. Look at that sky, it looks gorgeous. So this is another filming spot. What did the film here? Uh, 13 hours. 13 hours, I've heard of that film. Is that a 
It has like a little, like a, a, a clip from the film as well, oh, so you cool. can see it. Oh yeah. So oh I, gosh, yeah, Sudden Terror, The Devil's the Double, 13 Hours, The Promise, The Cut, and Munich. We need to find wow. the Game of Thrones one. We do need to find yeah, the Game I'm of Thrones one. We are a bit that. obsessed with that. Chilling out for a few minutes and taking in the beautiful sights of Malta. Of Malta. I like these parts where you can just sort of like wonder, wonder, sorry. And anywhere you go, you find something nice, like something pretty to look at or something, isn't it? Yeah, it's so easy to get about. Everything's like, really walkable. Yeah, and I like it where you just turn a corner and you're like, oh my god, look at that stunning view there. And yeah. This, that. And and we so. walked really far, and I mean, you can see how close the ships are. They're just there in the background. You've got the Costa one and the MSC Musica. Then our ship's just behind that, so you can see how easy and quick it is to get back to the ship. Mm -hmm. It's quite, there is some quite steep steps though, so if you fit in able, it's a yeah, pretty good place to exactly. visit. Exactly. But it is still accessible if you're in a wheelchair or anything. There's plenty of normal streets and stuff. Yeah. It just is quite steep, so just keep that in mind. It's been quite nice getting off the sort of like the main roads as well, hasn't it? And sort of going down all the back streets and things. It's Definitely, quite quiet. yeah. I just love exploring by myself. I mean, I do like tours as well, but it is so nice just to have the freedom to do exactly what you want. Yeah.